Tony's gone. I've been shopping. I've got enough food here for me and her, Stacey. Stacey's coming for a couple of days. Pretend you didn't see them. Although, they are only, I think it said, four and a half cents for 25 grams. I got this. Scarlet and Herb Spatchcock Chicken. That's uh, four and a half cents for a quarter. So, you do get four big uh, legs in there. So, that's all right. So, I'm going to make us a, a roast dinner in week. I have bought mince, got to make a lasagna. That is only four cents for the full jar, so between two of us, that's two cents. And instead of using the white sauce, which is very, very high in cents, what I'm going to do is blitz a can of macaroni cheese. Use that for me, um, me topping. I've got some salami, which is half a cent a slice and some am and reduced cheese. I also got some of these sub rolls. Um, so we can make our, our own Subway instead of going to Subway and pay, I think, I think Tony paid a tenner yesterday just for me. A six inch, one of them. I got some treats as well. Then. Baked pretzels, I love them. They're really 86 calories, so that's four and a half cents. Same with them. They're sour cream. So I made better choices. Still got oh look at this. They've started making their own version of the uh, strawberry and lime cider. I've scanned that but they haven't come up with um, how many cents that is yet. And I got this, right? 44 cents for that. So I'll be having a teeny, teeny piece. But she's only coming Tuesday. And what did I get for tea tonight? Food. I didn't get myself nothing. I've got some Greek yogurt because I'm going to show you how I make a strawberry mousse with that Greek yogurt and some strawberry jelly. So I'll go and find a place for all this. And I will see you all later. See you in a bit. Bye. I don't know if it's picking it up. But this caravan has not stopped moving. It's midnight. The wind's not died down. I keep going it on and checking. But nothing's gone over so far. Can you hear that? See you all in the morning, hopefully. Good morning. Well, we survived the bad weather. I tell you what, it was bloody windy. But she stayed stood up. Nothing wrong. But to be fair, everybody's awnings have stayed up. But it was, it was very, very bad. At one point at midnight, we heard an almighty crash. Uh, Paul, one of our neighbours, he come out with torch leaking, but we couldn't find where it had come from. Everybody's awning is still stood, so all is good. I'm just going to have a shower. I'm going to make some boiled egg on toast and then see what today brings. Hope you're all safe. Have a good day. Bye. Right, believe it or not, I have fixed the fridge. Look, all lit up. And it was the bottom of this door has never shut proper. It's always been stuck out at the bottom. So because it's been sticking out at the bottom, it has got all wet here. And there's, I don't know if you can see here at top, there's a little box there and a little box there. Toot this screw out. Dried it all. There was all water up there. There was a bit of water up there. So what I've done is I've got a cloth, put it up there and completely dried in there. Dried it all. And as soon as I dried it, the light come on. So all it was, was because the door wasn't shutting proper, 
it was condensation getting in. I mean, if you can see now, it's all dripping because that has been fixed. And do you know what was stopping this door? It's always stuck, stuck out at the bottom there. Look, now closing completely. And for three years, that drawer there has been just a touch forward, which stops the fridge door from shutting proper. Push it back a touch, nice and flushed, which stops the condensation building up here and getting in there. Now it's all been dry, put back together. I have light. So, £85 actually for a replacement LED light because Wendy's fridge has got a, a little box with a a bulb in. This hasn't, it's the LED strip. Saved myself £85. And if you believe I've fixed that, you're all thicker than Tony. I rang the solution man to see if he was on site. Luckily for us, he was. So, he come round and he fixed it for me. So all done. Right, we're going having uh, a ride out to Preston's, just having a look at some caravans because a certain Miss Addy over the road there wants a new van. So we're going having a look at some. Plus to pass time because I'm a bit bored. So I'm happy. Fridge is fixed. Thank you to the solution man yet again. See you all later. Bye. Right, well, we've been to Preston's. Wendy's fell in love with a couple of caravans. Um, I'm making my tea. I'm just showing you what I've started doing. I've started boiling my potatoes in beef stock. Well, some of you probably already do it. And then when I drain them, puff them up, roast them with a bit of fry light. It gives them a really, really nice taste. Like I said, some of you probably already know. But do that, you can do them in beef stock, chicken stock, vegetable stock, whichever stock. Just gives them a nice taste. It is the last day of me being on my own. I will admit I've been a bit bored. But Stacey and baby Alf is coming in the morning till Friday. So I won't have time to be bored. So, yeah, I just thought I'd share that little teeny tip with them. Um, me roast potatoes but get them tasty and mwah. right i'll see you all later goodbye see look how beefy they look i've just given them a good shake covered them with that bang them in there for half an hour 20 minutes and they'll be gorgeous i've not decided what i'm having with them but i'll leave them in there for about 30 minutes and i'll show you later uh, i'm bored i can just keep thinking of little teeny clips for me at this video i wish i've never said i'd do a video now because i've no video right bye until i think of something else goodbye so my roast potatoes are ready very very nice all i'm having is a, a can believe it or not from aldi of Chicken casserole and sweet corn. You don't always have hot coot laws when you're in caravan. Anything that's easiest, really. So why I'm on my own, that's what I'm having. So I shall go and enjoy these gorgeous roast potatoes. And I will see you all later. I can hear somebody's alarm or something going on. Not in here. See you in a bit. Bye. Right, I'm just making me an air stay set. Some, uh, a subway dupe is it called yeah. i got these rolls from aldi so i've got am salami cheese stacy's got am salami and the horriblest looking cheese i've ever seen she takes after her dad my kids do it's what is That's it nice to i'll just come what you're attacking me for cheddar with what's that i can't say i've not got my glasses jalapeno, jalapeno and, and is it spicy yeah you won't like it yeah i don't do spice so I'm having normal cheese. So I'll just stick them under there till cheese. Oh, hang on. I think that, that is a bit high actually. But I'll go under. It is, you know. Right, change of plan. Turn that off. I'll have to put it in the oven. It's too high. Not the cheese? Yeah. Right, speak to you all in a bit. Bye. 
Perhaps I'll have made her some dinner. I said I said that's melted enough for her. Don't put that in the in your grill. I thought I was like using my grill like I do at home. So that is mine with normal cheese. And that's our stasis with every spicy thing you can think of thrown in. Right, we'll have these and then we'll go, go out into Kirkham. So, quick lunch. See you in a bit. Bye. Hello. Hello. Are you cheeky? Aren't you cheeky? Yeah? Are you saying hello to everybody? He's having some me time on his little play mat. Say hello. 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 <laughs> Say bye bye. Bye bye. Morning. Me and little Alfie are having a little chill in the morning. We're going to live on St Anne's today for a day out. See if the sea will uh, help him sleep. It got very, very cold in caravan last night, didn't it? It says a baby's supposed to be kept between 16 and 20, so we didn't leave the eating on, but it got down to like 14. She's got a little egg, what tells you the temperature it's supposed to be. And uh, at three o'clock this morning, it went blue. She didn't wake me up. Don't know why she didn't wake me up. Um, but I put eating on, but he was in a little sleeping bag, so we were fine, but it was freezing. Tony's rung me this morning saying, oh, Andy General's been up for Hercules is leaving. You can hear it now, actually. It's, um, So, like I said, we're going to St. Anne's. What have a day? Oh, it is loud, dark. What have a day out by the sea? See the sea will uh, help us look. You know, for a baby, he doesn't nap. He has about 10 minutes here, rather, that's it. But he's settled into caravan life. It doesn't bother him, does it? So. We will see you all later. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> see you in a bit. We've had a ride into Lybum. Beautiful day. It's a bit windy. A bit of wind never did anybody any harm, did it? So we've got our walk up there on front. See you all later. Right, well, we've just got back from St. Anne's on Sea. Lovely day. Sun was shining, it was gorgeous. I'm gonna cook us this um, garlic and herbs spatchcock chicken. You just cook it in this in this tray. <laughs> uh, for 70 minutes. So I'll parboil some potatoes with that. <laughs> Somebody's enjoying his little self. Are you enjoying yourself there? You can see yourself. This is a mirror here. So we can... <laughs> you can see yourself and uh, talk to yourself. He slept all the way around St Anne's. So... Oh! Are you happy? Are you happy there? Yeah. So we're going to take him up to the family room up there later on and give him a bath. Because... Um, you used to be able to bath your kids in sink, but that sink is too small for him. So, I'm going to get, it says serves for that. 
a bit big just for me and a, a stairs. I didn't see it says serves full. But I suppose I can leave two pieces of it and we can have it on some sandwiches tomorrow for dinner. But it's not one not. Uh, yeah, it's from Aldi. So it's for text 70 minutes. I will pile bowl my potatoes and then I might chuck them in there. Not that I'm roasting there, but I can't be bothered to do anything really. So, right, I'm going to play with them for a bit. We will see you later. Bye. Alf is asking everybody a question. Look at that. Could I be any more cuter? Yeah. Are you cute? Do you think you're cute? Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Say bye-bye. I'm going to go be cute. Bye. Quick simple tea. And there's two pieces left for break up and put on uh, well, sandwiches tomorrow. Well, so we're going to get this see. eaten while uh, baby Alpha will let us. See you in a bit. Bye. Good morning. Well, hey, I don't know why I'm saying good morning, actually. It's 12 o'clock. The nuts have just been for a visit. It's Thursday. I stay seeing baby Alfie's last day. I've just said to her, can you go and visit Auntie Wendy just for 20 minutes? Just why I... Um, do this bam so she's gone across there I didn't know how much stuff a baby has well I did but I forgot so the van is in a estate <laughs> my rug's not been down all week it's there dirty baby clothes dirty my clothes the bedroom <laughs> is a shit tip that's the uh, stand for the Moses basket. The shower wants cleaning out because we've used that this morning. Would I have it any other way? No, I've enjoyed him being here. So I'm going to give it a good, well, take me 10 minutes, a good clean and lay some of this stuff up because they're going home in the morning. And then we're having a ride around to Dobby's. We was got white for tea, so I put the mints in the freezer, but we've decided we're staying in and having tea. So I shall go and blitz this before she comes back. And it's a shit tip again. Right, see you all in a bit. I've got to turn you around then, plus I see you all in a bit. I don't know why. I don't know what start, actually. Start in here. We'll look through to in there. See you after. Goodbye. That's my lasagna topped with macaroni cheese instead of uh, what do you have on it, Stas? Cheese sauce. Like that? Yeah, which is very high in sins. I'll show you where I've got cheese in about five minutes before end. I'll tell you how it turns out. Bye. That's how it's turned out with macaroni on it instead of cheese sauce just stuck a garlic bread in the uh, oven have some salad with it all good see you later afternoon i say afternoon even though i'm in my pajamas because uh as they say and alf is just gone i'm going to miss him for a weekend so i've got about one baby and gained another <laughs> He thinks he's got to come back this weekend and take over the vlog. Well, I've got news for him. He isn't. No, so, not. so you might see little bits of him. If I let him on. Because that's this, he didn't get on. She didn't no. want to, so... No. You might hear him talking in the background. Uh, can I have a stick, please? <laughs> Anything you want to say? I'll just pop him a stick. Anyway, my, t my caravan is getting back to normal now. Just click cleaned all the sweet because some little monkey puked on it, peed on it, pooed on it. That's the beauty about it being leather though. Yeah. Just wipes off. So I'm going to get dressed and then see what um, <laughs> he's looking at me like, pass me that stick. So I will hand over to part-time Tony Addy. <sighs>
got my stick back. It's not your stick. Yeah, uh, it is. I bought it. Hello, uh, I'm back. Uh, this is back. If you carry on, I'll turn it around in your pajamas. <laughs> um, I forgot what I was saying now. She's right. done about. She's done twenty minutes filming. No, no, I reckon we should end it here. And, uh, and you're all going, oh, we're driving around with me, Tony. No, we're going uh, out for a meal and that this weekend. So all right, we'll bits. carry on then. We'll carry on. Uh, yeah, I've got here, I've got, I've been doctors. I've got my um, doctor's appointment a bit early and I'm here now with my sweetie pie. Also, thanks for Steve Carroll. Got me done mega early, Steve. I really appreciate you lower, lowering my wages. Did you say it's better than Carl? Then what have you said that for? Isn't that what you've been saying? He's, I tell you what, he's better than Carl. No, I know Carl he's... runs me right at last minute. Steve Carl. Carol, <laughs> has me done. Thank you, Steve. <laughs> I, I can't... No, I'm in a position now. I can't say he's better than Carl. And I can't say Carl's better than him. You both say him. You both say him. You know I like me caravan on a Friday. I work out all week. Sunday afternoon till Friday. Usually afternoon. It's enough, ain't it? I'm not getting any younger, you know. Uh, so, yeah, so thanks, Steve, for that. Um, got to my doctor's early, like I said, had my injection, and then I'm here. Right, as you can see, I'm still in my work clothes. I'm going to go and get a shower now. Um, all right, is that it, sweetie pie? Yeah, it's the time being. It's not time being, no. All right, and then, like I said, we're going for a meal with the nuts and the pilkies in a bit. Well, tomorrow, sorry. All right, then. See you in a bit. Bye. Right, I said I would go make that mousse, didn't I? And uh, it's I'll show you how to do it, but I didn't get round to it. So this is like a, a slimming world version of um, Angel Delight. So you need one sachet of jelly. And then you whisk this until it goes very frothy. Tony bought me this at Christmas. Never used it. It's just been trying to tell me I've got used self to say. So you whisk it, and whisk it, and whisk it. So if you're making the jelly, you put half a pint of hot water and then half a pint of cold, but I'm not making the jelly. So you get loads of bubbles in it. Oh, that's fine, Ryan was the line. That's better for you, though, isn't it? This is. Right. So I'll leave that just for cool down for 10 minutes. There's loads of bubbles in it. And I'll show you rest in a minute when that's cooled down for 10 minutes. See you in a minute. Right. Can't remember if I told you. It's half a pint of hot water to that one sachet. That one sachet is one and a half cents. So to that, I'm going to pour eight tablespoons of this Greek natural fat-free Greek yogurt. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Give it another whisk. Can you see? You can use a hand whisk if you've not got one. Dishes. So when this is set, I'm going to pour 
solid the ah fat oh I've got to get another one of the ball actually ah fat squirty cream I'll show you that so that's one and a half sins for twelve and a half grams so it's one and a half sins for all that jelly and it's one and a half sins for the what's it we call it cream so i'll just put these in the fridge i've got enough actually mate tony tony one i've not i've only got two of them little glass dishes you'll not eat it but so all that there three and that is pretty deep for one and a half cents and then you put your cream on and your strawberries on top it's a dead dead nice dessert with not many cents right i'll show you after when i've creamed up when they've set see you in a bit about 20 times i've tried with this anyway look at me moose so it's one and a half sins. Don't forget, because that jelly is one and a half, and I've made three, so that is half a sin. And then on top, are you having some of this? You don't have to say Ian mentally that my name is every video. Well, we'll go use that next. Right, shut up. You know what? It's not your show anymore. So this, the <laughs> the lovely squirty cream, is one and a half sins for twelve and a half. So I've got my scales turned on. So I'm going to see. I don't want 12 and a half grams. That is only eight. Eight grams. So I, I'd say that is an, a sin. So for that old dessert. One and a half. Doesn't that look nice? Mm. You've got have yours? Mm. Are you got, do you want to try some of this? Yeah. While it's on there, then you can... I can't taste No, I know, but you can tell me if you think it's a moose consistent. I don't want you going yeah. being, yourself. being sad. No, I know you can. But do you think it's a moose consistency? Could you eat that like you do with your um, yeah, angel it's jelly? It's more jelly though. It is bloody jelly. Is it? But it gives, look, that don't look like jelly. I don't know. Don't know when I went to school that didn't look like jelly. Yeah, that's that. Is that mine? No. Do you want some? Obviously. So that's mine. Why am I saying that? I'm not in it. No. What I prepared earlier. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Are you taking the meat now? Do you want that? I can't eat all that tonight. Well, do you want me to give you some in a bowl? Do you want some squirted cream on it? I'll, no, I'll, I'll eat it all. You'll eat it all? Do you want some cream on it? Yeah, please, yeah. Tell me where to stop. Oh. There you go. Well, that's healthier. I bet that is about 12 and a half grams, actually. That's better than that um, Angel Delight, isn't it? Ah, I will get my spoon. And I will eat my. Try that. Dead simple. Dead easy. And it's very nice. You best eat all that, though. See you all tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Good morning. Saturday morning. Tony's been for breakfast and built gas up. How much did it cost? Twenty pounds ninety one pence, but it was completely empty. It, it turned was, off. It was born dry. I thought that keeps moving. Like keeps us come on toilet, so I thought I'll go and empty the toilet. What bird brain to the caravan keys with him? So it looks like he. Is emptying the toilet now. Oh, breakfast looks better than what you brought me yesterday. Which was because Tony drove like a lunatic, all it had all emptied and was all at the bottom of the cabbie bag. He wanted to scoop it out and let me eat it. I would have eaten it. Yeah, well, I would. So I don't know what we're doing today yet, do we? No, I'm not going to yet. So not going to See you all in a bit. I'll let you say bye. Really? Can I get on it? Yeah, well, go on. See you in a bit, everybody. Are you relaxing? I was asleep then. Oh, sure. What? We're talking on easy. Oh, I don't know. 
I heard you move, so I pretended I went to sleep. I just did that. I don't have to pretend if you want to go to sleep, go to sleep. Oh, it's nice, relaxing, isn't it? Nice it, day, isn't it? It is gorgeous, actually. So it's a shame, getting ready to go for a meal. Yeah, we're going out tonight. Look at that sun. It's beautiful. Do you want your uh, shirt, You're getting used to this vlogging now, you want Yeah, you? yeah. Eh? Yeah, look at that. Turning it round professionally. Turning it back professionally. <laughs> yeah, do you want your hair cutting? Please, if you don't mind. Right, I'm not going to film it because every time you film it, you decide to take a chunk out of my chest. I do that when I'm filming or not, anyway. Don't right, I? Okay. So, how will go me? <laughs> how will go make Tony look more presentable? Why is it flashing that? Flashing must be going. How will go make Tony look more presentable than what he does? It's a good job. I keep a kit in here, isn't it? Because yeah. his hair's a bit. So, Deborah to the rescue. Tell all your adoring subscribers you'll see them later. Yeah, can we now and then? What? Adoring subscribers? Yeah. Uh, we're going to go with that this weekend. They are. Uh, what? This? Stick, yeah. Oh. <laughs> you might get a go with the stick, but that'll be all. See you all later. Bye. Say goodbye. Again. <laughs> well, I'm just get, get ready for it. Go and see the nuts and the pilkies. And my ready, yeah. Sweet to buy is busy. What are you doing now? Oh, I know what I'm Emma. Making your dad, as requested by Tommy Addy, some scones. Some yeah, but he wants special scones, don't he? Well, see, well, he wants me to cut them and put jam in them. Right, okay. Can you do that? <laughs> hey, he can do it. He can put his own jam in them. Oh, damn. <laughs> He's oh. 82, you probably don't know how to do it. Tommy Addy knows how to do a lot of things. Oh, I thought you meant cut a little hole in top there. No, 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 and no. And just drop some jam in. No. He says, I'll have them with jam. Usually, you cut them yourself and put butter and jam in. Yeah, but. No. So you're not putting no jam in? <laughs> I don't know if I've got any jam. Right, oh, okay. So, Tommy Addy, your donuts. No, what are they called? Scones. Scones. Donuts, Tommy. Yeah. You're a donut. Deb will drop them off on the way home tomorrow. I'll get work. All right, then. Sweetie pie. See what a kind daughter-in-law I am. Yeah. Does it get me any brownie points? No. All right, okay. <laughs> All right, then. See you in a bit. Bye. Bye. I'm sure he was in that position, playing his games, the last time I videoed him. Have you moved today, love? Eh? Game. What game is it you're playing? Coin Master. Coin Master. It's what the caravan is all about relaxing. Oh, well, then when he's played his Coin Master, he'll play what's that? Pirate Kings. Pirate Kings. And then when I finish my Pirate Kings, it's time for some eating a beer. Why? How long do you think it's got to take you? I've got 48,000 spins. Oh my god. Oh. That is what Tony Addy does in his spare time, isn't yeah. it? Plays yeah. his games. Goodbye. Goodbye. Right, he's all ready. I'm all ready. I'm all ready. We are off to the ship to meet the nuts and the pilkies. We're walking. It's not raining, is it? I'm not walking around with you like that. It's so people don't recognise me. Oh, my God. So, yeah, we're going meeting them, having a meal, and then coming back, watching the poltergeist too. the other side, it's called. I haven't seen it. I don't recall seeing it. So, because... Tony, he's not going playing Dominus tonight. No. Oh, it's going to be 8 o'clock when we get back, isn't it? Mamma after. 8 o'clock? Our table's only about 5 or 7. Yeah, all right then. Jesus. We have chuck food day. No, I Get haven't. back. Yeah, he's not playing Dominus, so he'll be watching a film with me. So, we will see you in the morning. Good night. Good night. Sunday morning. Say morning, sweetie pie. Morning, sweetie pies. I'm having a go at this. Just before we go, well, uh, we're getting ready to go. We're going early. It's only ten o'clock, but it's really eleven o'clock, isn't it? Yeah, of course, went back an hour, didn't we? So we're going to go because I'm going to work. Uh, Deb's been here ten days, um, so yeah, I'm ready. She's ready for home. Uh, we've got a few shout outs. It's a different video this week. I hope you enjoy it. Yeah, all the Tony lovers, don't give me no weight because I'll just hate you back. <laughs> Why would you do that anyway? I'm 
play? I know they all love you, Mum and me, then. No. You're yeah. just doing that, no, so no. they'll all say it in comments that no. you're the no, mid no, the year so you were. She's got to do some shout outs anyway. This one is, we forgot to do it. So it's Charlotte. We're very sorry. She asked a few weeks ago to give her better half, Joe Wayne, a shout out. They said they love it here at Donkey Creek at Home and the Little Girl. So um, oh, when well. they come one time, they might meet us. Yep, there you go. Keith Simpson wants to wish, well, wants to say to his soon-to-be bride, which is on the 1st of November, which is Friday, he wants to tell you, Angela, that he loves you loads. Yep. Enjoy your day, you two. Yep, brilliant. And Margaret, we're getting maiden, is it? M-A-B-O-N. Mabon. Mabon. Wants to wish her husband Paul happy birthday for the 31st of October. So, happy, happy birthday, birthday, Paul. Paul. Is that it? Yeah. Right, okay. I'll go home and I'm going to do the review yeah. video on the Uber that I got sent. Yeah, last month. <laughs> it was winter. Yeah, we've been too busy. Time. Right, we're going to crack on then and we're going to we'll see you next. We might not be coming next Friday, might we not? Or, or we might come very late, we don't know. I'm going to our Angela's we're wedding. we wedding, so we might not get here Friday, we might just come Saturday. Uh, we'll see. It all depends what time I finish work, to be quite honest. But uh, we'll leave it there then, till next week. Yeah? Yes, if you haven't subscribed. Oh, by the way, uh, thank you to Martin and Angela. It was great to catch up with the Caravan Note again, yeah. wasn't it? And we can't get rid of the Pilkis, no. but, uh, but no, thanks for meeting Mark and Streeter. And we miss Callum. Callum came, didn't he? Yeah, he didn't. We didn't see him. Callum, you've got a pot round, lad. Yeah, I know. But now he's famous. Yeah, no, yeah, he's a yeah, famous yeah. photographer. You know, yeah. With all the famous football players. Anyway, so, great weekend with them again. And uh, we didn't show the shit because you've seen the shit that many times, haven't we? Right, we'll leave it there and we'll see you next week. Have a good week. All right. Bye. 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 Just said if you haven't subscribed, oh, please, please consider please doing so. Give us a thumbs up. All right then. See yeah, he gets hold of it and thinks he's <coughs> taking over. You see the difference. Yeah. Just pure glass. Right. I'll see it then. See you in a bit. Bye, sweet. Bye. I'm coming with you. Nice. Bye.